hey guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how i revive my hair from dry frizzy to this moisturized fluffy looking hair using my own diy condition and shampoo this video is highly requested and finally i filmed a video of how i make my own shampoo and conditioner <music> So the first thing we need for this video is a clean glass plate. The next thing is our blast soap. So I got this blast soap from a local market here in Nigeria. I actually got the full one. So I've been using this for, for a while now. So this is like half of the one remaining. All I just did was cut out a smaller portion I'm going to be using. Because I wouldn't like to do a lot of this uh, shampoo and conditioner. You can try to do a lot and preserve it if you want. But I just wanted to do something that I will finish at once. So that anytime I'm, I'm rewashing my hair or doing it again, I'll be doing a new, a new one entirely. So after smashing the black soap... In my glass uh, plate i just pour in a very small hot water i use my spoon to match it together to dissolve it into the water and give it a more liquid consistency this african blast soap contains cocoa coconut oil shea butter which help to relieve dry scalp and also help to soften your hair when you use it as shampoo without leaving your hair dry dry or frizzy so all the content in this black soap is very safe for our hair strand and scalp at this point i'll go ahead and strain it in case of any sand in this black soap you don't want the sand on your scalp or your hair strand even after straining it out you'll be feeling some sand from the residue and this is why you have to strain it up next is our apple cider vinegar i'm going to be using this 83 ml cup for my measurement Apple cider vinegar contains good amount of vitamin and mineral that is very good for our hair. Vitamin like vitamin C and B and it also contains alpha hydrazine which helps to exfoliate the scalp skin and it also helps to clear dandruff and any scalp diseases and also it also helps to hydrate your hair. So at this point I add in some glycerin and essential oil which is also very good at keeping your scalp healthy away from any form of dryness inches or dandruff so at this point i just transfer it to my spring bottle and this is ready to be used then we move over to our conditioner our shampoo is ready now is our conditioner so for our conditioner i'm going to be using this measuring cup and i'm i will be pouring in some uh, measurement just in case you're using my measurement i'm using about 200 gram water for this particular one and the next thing is ambunu i have made a video uh, about this ambunu on my channel here and i'm using this uh spoon this is a half of teaspoon yes to measure my ambunu ambunu is an old traditional herbs used by uh, women of chad mostly for their hair care and their hair treatment it is used for hair detangling, hair treatment, and hair conditioning. Ambunu help to soften your hair, had a good amount of shine to your hair, help you grow stronger and thicker hair, and also prevent your scalp from drying out, and it also prevents hair loss. So this is how it looks. It's kind of slippery. It gives you this thick, slippery consistency, as you guys can see, depending on your measurement. Up next is our aloe vera. Aloe vera is very good for hair treatments. It helps to condition your hair, moisturize your scalp and your hair strands, save your hair from drying out. And we also know that aloe vera promotes hair growth. All you need to do is just extract out the gel, blend it and strain it out so you will have uh, particles or residue. After doing that, now you mix your aloe vera. Now your aloe vera is ready. You mix your aloe vera with your ambunu juice. I go ahead and stir it together and it's going to give you this slippery consistency you guys know that aloe vera is slippery and bunu too is slippery so these are both very very good conditioner i just went ahead and add in some oil i add about two tablespoons of olive oil and two tablespoons of my coconut oil then i went ahead and uh, transfer it to my bottle and this conditioner is ready to be used so at this point this conditioner is ready and my shampoo too is ready so this is my diy shampoo and conditioner 
and i hope you guys understand this video because this if you ever try out this video believe me you will not even spend your dime on buying any conditioner again because this work perfectly well so this is my hair before anything this is my hair looked like dry and all of that so at this point of course i'll go ahead with my shampoo first and wash my hair first of all i'll apply it to my scalp like the scalp is the main thing and while i'm doing this i would like to share something with you guys number one is that if you guys watch my video closely i usually don't use comb maybe few time like i usually don't use comb all the time like maybe let me just say two out of ten two out of ten times i use comb and this has helped me a lot to retain my length and again i don't get my hair breaking off unnecessarily so what i do is that i do a finger dangling if you guys watch my video you will hardly like you will hardly see me use comb i usually use my hand for everything and again when you're shampooing you should pay more attention to your scalp not your hair strand your hair strand will always clean up themselves from the foam from the shampoo but you should pay more attention to your scalp use your fingers to kind of scrub your your scalp you know so what i'm trying to say is don't be too aggressive even though this video is looking like i fast forward it i was very very gentle with my hair strand while i was a bit a bit aggressive with my scalp because i know that i have to like scrub it just so it will come out very clean so what i noticed about the shampoo is that guys this thing clean my hair so well it works like a surface shampoo if you guys know surface shampoo it cleans your like it literally deep cleans your hair very well and that's what i'm feeling at this point i'm actually shocked guys because my hair was still fluffy like for all the other shampoo that i've used in the past you know this is normal with shampoo when you're shampooing your hair it still up your hair but this one was fluffy so guys I, you guys can see i've emptied all the shampoo and my hair was so fluffy at this point i regret not sharing this with you guys earlier because i've been using this for a while now and just for one reason or the other i felt i will share it each time i want to make this video i'm like okay later later but thank god i finally made this video because this really worked very well my hair was not even that uh stiff together so i went ahead and washed it out after making sure my hair is clean wash it out then go ahead to apply my conditional so i want to also point out that ambuno also have this foam thing going on like it foams your hair like you have soap in your hair if you've used ambuno before you you definitely can relate to what i am saying so it also help you to be able to uh, clean your hair very well and this thing clean your hair so well it moisturizes your hair it just feel like you're adding gel and water to your hair Coupled with the aloe vera there, it's a very, very good conditioner for your hair. This soft in my hair, even my curls were popping, you guys can see like this is giving me exactly what conditioner does. Softening your hair from away from the stiffness you've gotten from your shampoo. My hair was so, so soft, like so soft. I, felt, I just feel like I was adding uh, water and gel like i'm adding water and gel to my hair because my hair was so soft and this also helped to treat your hair it treats a hair dryness scalp inches or uh, dandruff any form of scalp disease at all this ambunu help you treat it like i mentioned earlier this is used by women of chad and if you guys know their history they have very long hair so you guys can see that I've empty all this uh, shampoo and conditioner and depending on your measurement like i said earlier i didn't want to preserve it i knew that it's something i could do anytime i want so depending on you if you want to preserve it that means you have to make more and if you want to do the one you finish at once then you can follow my measurement so guys i want to warn you guys make sure you're doing this in your bathroom because all my body is soaked you guys like you guys can see my bathroom there's no light in my bathroom so i couldn't so make sure you do this in your bathroom if not it's messy i won't even lie to you guys so guys i went ahead and washed out my conditioner oh my hair was feeling so good my hair was feeling so light more like it was really so light you guys can see it was feeling fluffy my scalp was clean i was so surprised guys my scalp was clean my hair felt so good so guys at this point i'm so happy the results guys my hair felt so good you guys can see felt fluffy i love this so much my hair felt so good guys and this is very perfect for this weather we all know that this weather is dry this is very very perfect for this weather for me this is 10 over 10 please try out this and thank me later so guys i share a lot of hair treatment natural hair treatments here on my channel if you like any content like this please do go ahead and hit that subscribe button i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys